Hello again, I'm sorry to be posting another replay, but um, I've been playing the Corsair FOU1A lately, and I'm just... I could not predict this was uh, going to happen, I just noticed something very strange. You see, at the start I've just climbed, trying to climb to the, si to the sides, because um, the enemy had lots of uh, planes high up, and I wanted to try and get an altitude advantage. So I'm just observing, getting altitude, basically, uh, for a good while, and then I decide it's time to turn into the battle, and I hit the rudder, and oh my gosh, I just hit the rudder once. I can tell you that was this crazy spinning was not on purpose. I can promise you that. I'm, I'm thinking I'm going to lose my plane or something, and then finally. I only have like several spins, and this is arcade, mind you. Not sim or anything. Please don't usually do this in arcade. <laughs> uh, well, uh, it happens every time. Once you release the rudder, it goes into a crazy spin that's almost impossible to get out of. Oh my gosh. Yeah. But finally I've got my plane back more or less in it's intact and uh, so I decided to try and climb back up and I realise like, there's now this guy in the J2M seems to be up there, a Japanese plane, and he seems not really to be paying as much attention as he should to a lower down plane. So I try and sneak up on him and Yep, uh, I've been struggling like hell with the 50 cals uh, using stealth belts, by the way, and then I suddenly I just switched to the omnipurpose belt, and I get it. I hit the rudder key again and another crazy spin. The omnipurpose belts just seem to be doing a bit better, but more spinning. Um, there, there's a bomber down there. I go for a second. I do get that one, I think. Yep, I got that one. And I use the rudder again and another crazy spin. <laughs> I mean, don't just 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 don't hit the rudder. The one I call said, just 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 don't. Unless, unless I spot uh, up there a Japanese fighter with altitude again. And I think if I'd realised it's actually the same guy that I fought before, I wouldn't have been so cocky. Because um, I try and do the same thing again: climb up at him, hoping that he's oblivious, that he sees me as not a threat, since I'm so much lower than him. But this time, um, he sees me, he evades, and he's in a zero, a much more maneuverable plane than my course is, I'm obviously in a bit of a spot of bother. I try to just speed away, um, and I do that for quite some time, actually, and I'm sort of gradually, only very gradually, pulling away from him, he's even climbing, gaining more speed and stuff, so eventually I get tired of that, and just... Yeah, I just get tired of being chased off everywhere and decide to just re-engage. Thinking that my dog will at least have got me more speed. And trying for a head on and then I, I did land some hits, but I need to land some hits on me as well. And then basically I want to just try and go into sort of an evasive dive, I think, but instead... <laughs> well... Uh, at least he had a pretty hard time aiming for me and all almost crashed right into me right there. Because uh, I was in this crazy spin. I bet he wondered how the hell I was pulling off those kind of, of, of crazy uh, maneuvers. Uh, Nicole said that he couldn't follow in a zero. I think it, it may have helped actually evade some of his shots, but it's not exactly controllable or nor advisable. Ah! It's completely out there! This has to be a bug. Surely the flight model of a plane doesn't suggest whenever you just try to hit gently rudder a little bit. 
Okay, that was okay since I kept my mouse cursor on the red. But, but then have my mouse cursor somewhere a bit different. It tries to get back to that. No, it. This crazy shit. Yep. No, no, it's not. This not. This is not good. This is not good. All I did was hit the rudder and then point the mouse that I wanted to find somewhere else and kaboomy. 